it's weird in Canada. Well, it's funny that you should make that joke about the beaver because I not too long ago, that was definitely an inside joke in terms of Canadian content and what Canadian content actually meant in Canada. And it wasn't too long ago. It really, really wasn't. It was, I would say, 10 years ago, maybe 12 years ago, uh, Canadian content was like Mounties, Lumberjacks, and Beavers. And now, because there's been like a huge lobbying and sort of equity uh, on the federal and provincial levels to sort of redefine what Canada cultural diversity is, which is essentially every other country in the world, including Canada, um, because it's so multicultural in, in every major city. Um, so I, that, that allows me to, to get funding to tell stories. Um, like my first documentary was about um, essentially my father self-diagnosed himself with Alzheimer's in order to justify his own euthanasia because uh, so he thought he had it and and that took the film to Chile and so it was a sort of co-production with Chile and half of it was shot in Chile and half of it was shot in Toronto um, and I got funding for it on all all three levels and that wouldn't have happened 15 years ago or at least it would have been really difficult and they would have been like but that's not a Canadian film and so I think that's right now is being is definitely being redefined and um, and what that diversity is and what that actually means so it's a good time to be uh, not white in Canada <laughs> right now at least it's getting better because it, those stories weren't allowed to be told like we didn't get funding for those stories to be told and I think it's like I think it's a really great thing and a, um, and a really important thing um, to, to be able to tell those, those, uh, those, those uh, stories from all over the world.